after coming to know the uh, definition of the transforms properties of uh, the transforms and uh, list of uh, standard uh, z transforms now we are going with uh, solving the problems on uh, z transforms so consider the problem find the z transform of e power minus an into n square what we are required to find find the z transform of e power minus an into n square i want to know this value i want to know this value the problem is of the form it is of the form z transform of k power n into u n how to analyze this how to analyze this problem it is here we have function of n square a polynomial term called n square consider that as u n and this can be written as we have exponential term here it can be written as k power n so the problem will be of the form called k power n into u n so z transform of k power n into u n is what u bar of z by k the final answer will be in terms of u bar of z by k now i will go with the comparison of uh, the problem in place of u n i have n square so i want to find out z transform of n square so according to the list of uh, z transformation uh, standard uh, list we have z transform of n square as z square plus z divided by z minus 1 the whole cube z square plus z divided by z minus 1 whole cube so i will retain this definition and i will apply this definition uh, for uh, the above equation so therefore in place of un just i will put n square you are going to get k power n z transform of k power n into n square is what replace z by z by k replace z by z by k so it is nothing but z by k the whole square plus z by k whole divided by z by k minus 1 the whole cube so simplifying this taking lcm so z square lcm is k square here k square by uh, k we have so lcm is k square k z whole divided by uh, also here also take out uh, the lcm z minus k whole divided by k the whole cube the whole cube so simplifying this we are going to get z square plus k z divided by k square whole divided by whole divided by z minus k whole cube whole divided by k cube so k cube and k square get cancel one term of k is left out here that k will be multiplied to the numerator it becomes k z square k times of z square plus k z whole divided by z minus k the whole cube so which is nothing but what k z square plus k square z whole divided by z minus k the whole cube so this is what z transform of k power n into n square k power n into n square finally what i want to find finally i want to find z transform of e power minus an into n square so go with the comparison of what we have here k so k power n is equated with e power minus an so it can be written as k power n k whole power n can be written as e power minus a whole power n by loss of indices so therefore i came to know that k is equal to e power minus a so therefore z transform of e power minus a whole power n into n square is nothing but what e power minus a into z square plus k square k square is nothing but k square can be written as e power minus a the whole square which is nothing but e power minus 2a so therefore it is e power minus 2a into z whole divided by z minus e power minus a the whole cube is the required z transform of e power minus an into n square